Hello everyone, Stas is here, I'm back with some more OSG3. Today we're gonna start a new playthrough. And we're gonna play as a druid, finally. I think we're gonna skip the cinematic because we've seen it already a couple of times. I bet who's interested can find it. Alright, our new custom character, sleeve, classic name, uh, background, uh, we need, what do we need? I believe we need wisdom, but I don't think any survival proficiency, sage, arcana, history, athletics, Acolyte, you have spent your life in service to a temple, learning sacred rites and providing sacrifices to the god or gods you worship. Serving the gods and discovering their sacred works will guide you to greatness. Does it go well with a druid? Let's take a druid right away. I don't know. Side proficiency. Religion. Like, druids are supposed to worship nature and protect it. Could they be considered acolytes? Not charlatan, definitely. Not criminal. Oh, here, you are a champion of the common people, challenging tyrants and monsters to protect the helpless, saving innocents. In imminent danger will make your, your legend grow. Animal handling proficiency. Don't we have it as a druid already? We do have it. Not artisan. Outlander. You grew up in the wilds, learning to survive far from the comforts of civilization. Surviving unusual hazards of the wild will enhance your prowess and understanding. Athletics and survival. That's actually closer to, to the druid. It's a very nice outfit, by the way. Age. You're curious and well read with an unending th thirst for knowledge. Learning about the rare lore of the world will inspire you to put this knowledge to greater purpose. Cain and history. Uh, Rockman Dasher. I hope I didn't butcher it too much. Uh, welcome to the stream. I wonder if we can improve our backgrounds through play. Uh, we certainly unable to do that in early access. And honestly, I'm not sure if we will we will be able to do that in a full version, unfortunately. To be fair, it doesn't change like much. You get some proficiencies with it, and uh, probably a couple of extra options in dialogues. But it's kind of rare. Like, my first character was Paladin with a noble background. And first, I never used this option because I had other ones available as well. And uh, I didn't encounter noble options too often. Like, I, I think it was called Baldurian. Like, my paladin was a Baldurian, citizen of Baldur. And it was rare to see the option related to it. Virgin, after surviving a poor and bleak childhood, you know how to make the most out of very little. Using your street smarts bolster your spirit for the journey ahead. That's, that's also not a druid one. Nature. Nature is like a basic thing. Sight, religion. I honestly am not sure what to choose.
I look for Outlander and Sage for now. I want to play Moon Druid. I want to transform into animals. So I'm not sure if I need Arcana, Arcana that much. Maybe Athletics and Survival though. Hi, hello, Sir Mace. How is it going? I want to be a noble drow cleric for my play and try to raise my house in service of love. Oh, you can certainly be a drow cleric. Mm, don't know much else. Like, I have completed uh, early access a, a day or two ago, and uh, there's not many places available to visit, so I'm not sure if it's even possible to, to raise some house. Though I bet you can roleplay it pretty well if you're good enough at this. Especially if you play with friends, I guess. You can make fully customizable party. Alright, what, what did I want to do? I wanted to continue, I guess. I have betrayed the Empire and joined the Vlandians. <laughs> How many towns do you have? Only one? Did you do it only to not lose Sargot or whatever town you get? One. Oh yeah, the race choice. I wanted to play high half elf. I wouldn't want, I think. And yeah, I believe we need Wisdom. We don't need Strength. Don't need much Dexterity. Constitution, probably. Charisma plus two. Alright, it looks, it looks okay. Oh, Half Elves have higher movement speed it's kind of good I guess I wonder if it will work in uh, animal form mask of the wild you were raised to blend into your natural surroundings you gain proficiency in stealth ah, we don't really need it I don't want to get another one to have a lot of tribute but not putting defenders or just a small amount in it I believe it's gonna be hard to hold a town or a castle without a big garrison to rebel, rebel like sooner or later, most likely sooner. Where to next? Why so dark? Mean-looking half-elves. And I don't really want to spend too much time on this. Alright, let's leave it like that. Any more? More exquisite for a hairstyle. Though it's a druid. I guess a hairstyle should look like a bird's nest, like that, for example. Yeah, but they never rebel against me because I only take Vlandian or my culture type of cities. I guess that makes it easier. Because when I was playing, <laughs> I could get only towns that are not my, my culture. Like, we have a lot of options seemingly, but they're not that great, somehow. Damn it.
a lot of options, but they're all weird. But are you a vessel of Windance or are you just a mercenary? Someone spends so much time on all of this. Let's go with the basic one. Nice beers as well. No. No beard. What hair color could drew it wear? And having low security is not the worst to have. I'm a vessel. So you fought against them. And now you're a vessel. Kinda questionable reputation follows you. I don't know how that's too hard for me. And Greying him. Could Druid wear a tattoo, I wonder. <laughs> Probably this one. It's a Mind Flare follower. Crap. That reminds me about uh, Wooden Elves from uh, Dragon Age. They always wore some kind of uh, tattoos. Hey dude, so he's starting again. Hello, the Unknown Ranger. Welcome to the stream, and yeah, I have finished uh, my Paladin playthrough a day or two ago, and I want to try another class, Druid, to be exact. So yeah, starting again. My city is glitched because it won't construct anything. Do you have enough uh, loyalty in it, though? How do you know if it's glitched or not? Like, are there some obvious indications? I think this Halston Druid wore some kind of a tattoo, but I don't remember. Probably this one, actually. I don't know, that looks weird. <laughs> that looks weird, it's like some... Almost like Mike Tyson style tattoo, but bigger. Can you change color? Yeah, like that. Hell yeah, let's go on full war paint. I don't know, let's do it like that. I'm so bad at this character creation. Right class, that is the most interesting part. Thorn Whip, I believe this is a very great spell, even if we will be in a animal form for the most time, but still. Shirilag. What the hell is this? Imbue staff or club with the nature's power. It becomes magical. Deals 1d8 plus 3 bludgeoning damage and uses your spell casting ability for attack rolls. I don't know, do we need it? Reduce flame. A flicking flame appears in your hand. It shields bright. It sheds bright light in a 9 meter radius and deals 1d8 fire damage. Will it work if I will go into animal form? Throwing the flame immediately after you conjure it does not cost an action. Interesting. Though I guess conjuring still costs an action, which is not great. Extinguishing or throwing it on subsequent turns costs an action. I don't get what it is. What do I want? Do I want this thing or this thing? Uh, light could be good, though we have dark vision. That could help teammates. Uh, let's leave. Let's keep this one. I'm not sure about this. Contrips. 
Alright, prepared spells. This is more more interesting. Cure wounds. Melee, we don't want melee. Fairy fire is a good one. I want to get into this again, but playing so much at my at minute. You mean to play other games right now? What are you playing if if I may ask? Oh, I think you've mentioned you've been going through previous Baldur's Gate games, right? Honestly, if you're familiar with the game, you know what you want to play and release. I think I would uh, wait until August, until the game will re be released, or even September, probably. I am playing because I want to figure out what class I want to play when the game will be released. And I didn't play it before, before my previous playthrough, which I did recently. Yeah, I have low loyalty because Vlandi has a stupid policy and I have low security, but that's it, so... I believe if you have, if you have loyalty lower than certain point, lower than uh, 25 or 30, I think, nothing is gonna be constructed in uh, the settlement. That's like a game mechanic, actually. I believe that's some... crappy spell. Jump... Entangle... Entangle demands concentration. And concentration is kind of bad. Charm person. Animal friendship. Hmm. It's kind of a very druid spell. Could take it. Though it's prepared spells, we can choose later. Yeah, let's let's go like that. Yeah, I've been playing the other Baldur's Gate. My friends got me back into Apex Legends. One of my other friends been playing Rainbow Six with her. Rainbow Six Siege? How is Siege doing right now? Last time I've played like many years ago. I think uh, when this uh, cost map came out, I don't remember how it was called. Like this not so big building and some cost where, uh, and it has like an open area in the middle. What's your favorite character in Apex? Are you playing Apex as well, Sir Mace? I've played Apex when it came out with a friend. But when friends stopped playing it, I, I also wasn't interested anymore. It was fun at first, like very fast-paced game. It's alright, still questionable sometimes. I see. It feels like uh, Rainbow Six is it's a game that always tr like constantly trying to find itself, find it, its own identity, changing a lot of stuff, screwing up a lot of stuff. I found it way better in the start, but now I find it bad. A lifeline and Bloodhound on my mains. I think Lifeline is the one I played. It's a medic girl, right? I think I've played her. Oh man, skills with proficiency. We can change it actually, but they're good. Uh, wait, what about um, origin? Athletics, okay, athletics. Alright. Persuasion is not our strong side, but whatever. My paladin was good at persuasion, I guess we will play different character and dialogues this time. Abilities, so here we go, this is the interesting part. I believe we don't need a lot of strength. Sometimes Bangalore. I don't even know who it is. Watson. I think these are new characters I've never seen. A lot of wisdom. 
We need some more intelligence. Charisma. I would like to go like that. Tell me, who do you dream of at night? Oh yeah, this demon. Where are you? The demons will visit us at night a couple of times and never return. So many horns variations. Hell yeah. Ram horns, let's go. This foul demon such heretics. True. They are. Full Karen mod, let's go. And evil looking goatee. Hell yeah. It's our demon that will haunt us. I don't know what hair color would Karen Demon have. It was blonde, actually. I don't know, blonde looks weird. Ah, well, whatever. There's... Some over the top looking tattoo. What happened to her? <laughs> Let's leave it a mystery. No cinematics. You've seen them already. Here we go. Alright, I believe we will have. We'll get an ability to turn into animals on that level too. So we are kinda. kinda weak right now. And we'll choose the subclass as well at level two. Might still be stuck inside if we hadn't been attacked. Someone else got out. And there's chest. How do we get there? I think my previous character could just jump up here on this one. Taste. Yeah, we're not a good jumper anymore. Like this move was. Because our strength is kinda low. I never use these bombs. Maybe I should do this. Should use them in this playthrough. I don't know, there's another chest. Rain bulb. I don't think I want to break it. Maybe not right now, maybe later. 
or never, most likely. The nursery is where, where this guy took our this worm. This is the pool that thing came from. The parasite now writhing behind your eye. Yeah, this little guy. <laughs> Natural one, let's go. Good start of a playthrough. Now let's not touch this. Certainly not the greatest idea. Ocean speed, that's a cool thing that we find like right at the start of the Dead. game. Good. What an angry druid we have here. Dead Thrall. Let's check out his pockets. Okay. Man, such a small jump radius. I have some problems with uh, traversing some stuff. Though actually we'll have some animal forms that will help, I guess. Right. Devilkin, am I in the house? Devilkin. Brain jar. Nasty looking stuff. Looking place it reminds me about uh, collector's base from Mass Effect 2. They also look like some insect creatures. Odd. Release us. That's our old friend, a little brain. brain quivers in expectation. Please. Before they return! They return. You sound afraid. Why? The enemy. So many enemies. Um... Who am I talking to? A man or a brain? A Born. Born near from this husk. You know no creature like this. One that is more brain than person. I think you're past the point of saving. Tell me what to do. Remove us from this body. From this case. Free us. Let's start to inspect first. And that's a good roll. You notice a demon, a Not like a previous brain, one. Causing pressure where it strains against the shell of the skull. Uh, medicine. We have advantage. Let's go. Attempt a cerebral extraction, staying mindful of the swelling. I don't think we had this when we played Paladin. And we didn't have... Or we did, I don't remember. I certainly chose Strength. That was much, much better role for us. Easy. A 
The animation, animation looks the same the brain as when you use strength. But you notice an opportunity. You could cripple the strange creature, making it more subservient, should it prove a threat. Nah, spare the creature. It's our friend, little brain. He's harmless. We are free. Our freedom is ours, friend. The creature pauses, listening. Something behind your eyes seizes in recognition. We must go to the helm. But the helm, we are needed. Now, what should I call you? Us. We are us. We are Legion. What is it the hell? The brain tenses, as though querying an unseen advisor. Do you not hear it? We will not survive here. We are needed to navigate. We are needed to leave this realm. Alright, let's go. To the helm we go! We are going to the helm. Such a cheerful little guy. Oops, nope, no loot. You've seen everything in here. And just just go my brain now I have more than one brain cell doesn't do anything can we even do this jump no not really I'm so used to a character with high strength can jump like real far. Lizale. Abomination. This is your end. All your horses. Your and your skin tingles. Visions rush past. A dragon's wing, a silver sword, and a flash of your face seen through the strange woman's eyes. Oh, my head. What is this? Squaw, you are no thrall. Blacketh blesses me this day. Together, we might survive. Imps block the path forward. You will assist me in destroying them. We must reach the helm before we transform. Who the hell are you? Who am I? Your only chance of survival. Hey. One word then. First, we exterminate the imps. Then we find the helm and take control of the ship. Okay, let's go. As for that thing, it will remain tame as long as it believes we are thralls. Yeah. There's no one. It may be of use in the fight to come. Okay. Is Ceres with us? We try to sneak. Damn, look at his damage. I should have attacked with Lizelle. Uh, we, we know how combat works, hopefully. Oh, she's still in stealth. She did good. This guy's stealth as well. Man, I didn't know you can cheese this easy fight that much. How many enemies? One? Eh, scary fight. Man, this whip. So cool. 
You could pull enemies of, of the cliffs with this. Oh, that's a good damage. I guess we had better all you before that. Surprisingly adequate in battle. Now, what do you mean I was marvelous in here? Such a well planned attack. Wait, excuse me? Did this L get crossbow? Oh, I can't equip her, I guess. Okay. She's like not in my team yet, just a guest. I didn't miss any loot. I missed this guy. And this one. Alright, looks good. Don't even need this healing. What path lies before me? I'll be all right. The mind flayers have already enthralled her. The absolute Leave amulet. Her, or we will share her fate. Oak Marta will patch me up. She's on her way. On her way. All right, we can't help. We'll whatever the secrets. Can we jump on the other side in here? She can do this. Okay, let's go. Loot, please. Oh, she can't loot. Damn it. Oh well. Most likely there's nothing valuable. At least things have stayed interesting. In the oh, boo. Oh, lend a hand, won't you, love? There's a rat in the kitchen. Ten red rats. Uh, and they're flying and they're clawing. They have some serious infestation here. And this guy also has uh, absolute uh, amulet. So many teeth! So, either mind flayers target this absolute people or, or it's a really big thing in this place. Can we hit in the back this guy? Damn, wasn't I hidden? Yes, I wasn't. Good. Second wind. Nice dodge. Just use a whip. Finish him. Easy. Well, I guess it's kinda early, but 
I like Druid so far. Another amulet. I think I'll go to bed early. The first time I was playing, I already noticed that they had the amulets, but How much farther can I had no I idea what they mean. I'm still not really sure, but we know that it's tied to, to the absolute. It's false god. Okay, okay. Do not delay. Do not delay. Let's go then. The hell. This sphincter door again. You disgusting. Oh, it's Shadow Heart place again. I think I screwed up like big time back. here previously with this. Touch nothing without knowing its purpose. Okay, okay. Can you read? Unleash. Can't read the script. Mm. Yeah, man. Maybe I should. Get Shadow Heart first. You get me out of this town thing. We have no time for stragglers. Look for ledge. Construction is too alien. Nothing looks familiar. This ship is crashing. Do you intend to die for a stranger? We must go. To the helm, we must go. Come Need more at least. There's got to be a way to open it. I go look around. Try that contraption next to the pot. They did something to it when they sealed me in. Hurry! Please! Please. Let's not touch. Just yet. Yeah, I think we need to open this. First, we need a key. Just another blue brain. Skra. How many hosts of these gay infected? A dazed woman is trapped inside the pod. She doesn't notice you. That's rude of her. Oh Noah, hello. How is it going? Man, having you friended on Discord is great because I can know when you are gonna stream before streaming because I see you entering Baldur's Gate before the stream lol. How about your streaming? When are you gonna continue your nocturne adventure? Or tyranny. For what? I've also started to tackle my backlog with Witcher 2. Could mean anything. And probably with Death Stranding later. My much later. <laughs> don't know yet, I don't have a schedule stream, I feel like. Yeah, same. Same here. Though I stream a lot more lately. I'm playing Horizon Zero Dawn right now, though. I think you've been playing it for a while. You've mentioned it, like, way before when I've started to stream uh, Mountain Blade. Hell in Sharoon, that's what we need. And how is, uh, how is Horizon Zero Dawn? I've heard a lot of good things, but... Never looked interesting to me. 
just some generic uh, Ubisoft-like open-world game, from what I can understand. The, the one that looks good, uh, but to be fair, Assassin's Creed games are also good-looking. Let's insert the, the room. Yeah, I started playing it again after a break, just exploring the map, doing side quests and stuff, also it's great. Okay. Is the story any good? Machine hunting is great. Yeah, I've seen like there are giant uh, mech animals that have different weak spots. You need to like figure them out, use their weaknesses, hunt them down. Pulsing glow and organic lines of the device make it seem more like a beating heart than a machine. Perhaps it will open the nearby pod. Yeah, let's open it. Suddenly, you feel a hideous squirming in your head. A parasite. Then discomfort fades, and another sensation. I haven't progressed with it yet. I'm planning to Connection. explore the map entirely, then do the main quest. That's kind of what I did in all the uh, Assassin's Creed games, like Assassin's Creed 2, 4, 3. First you visit every tower and then you do missions or quests. Should ignore the sensation or have 3 wisdom, let's try this roll. Ooh! It's, uh, we can't fail it, apparently. Uh, even if, even with natural one. Let's what? Am I blind or or it's some weird D and D math? Oh well, storage should do hard. Feel the biomechanical brain of the console process your command. All right, this druid is uh, not great at the rolls for now. Worse than Paladin. The console hums steadily, awaiting command. Yeah, uh, we will not get Shadowheart. And we can do it again. Nah, <laughs> We can't do it again. <laughs> I don't Nothing like this rules. The of the device betrays its purpose. Yeah, the try it again. Hums steadily, awaiting uh, how we can do it again and again? It's kind of weird. The pulsing. Maybe it's because it this ship is kind of tutorial. That's why we can. No, we can't really. Yeah, it's, it's useless at this time. At this point. I'm playing on the hardest difficulty, the hardest one doubles the prices for stuff and I don't like that. Noxion does that too, but it's negligible. I'm dying in two to three hits from every machine. So the best thing I could do is get the best weapons I can buy and some armor, but it would still be hard. Okay. How many difficulties it has in total? I guess it's not the hardest. I wonder how the hardest one looks like. Can the Zell do that? The console hums steadily, awaiting command. Not really. Nothing in the appearance of the device betrays its purpose. Oh, she can. Let's try it. do anything. Easy. We have managed. We roll more than zero. You feel the biomechanical brain of the so to be fair, we have rolled one, mind. but I guess natural one means like insta lose. Runs across your mind. 
in D and D. Yeah, there's our go. Shavard dropped like a sack of potatoes. <gasps> I thought that damn thing was going to be my coffin. Thank you. Your mind lurches into her thoughts. Her gratitude is mixed with wariness. Because you have a gith with you. You keep dangerous company. I think this is the one I chose in the first playthrough. Uh -huh. Did you feel it just now? We were in each other's heads. I did. It must Story is a normal heart, is very we'll hard. Ultra hard, it balances the first. weapons, enemies Let deal more damage you. and are more aggressive. We can get off the Emerges where wears cost double. That's kind of interesting thing to... To adjust the prices for difficulties. I don't remember many games doing that. Though maybe I never paid attention. Alright, let's get going. Shadowheart. One moment. On the ultra hard does it oh. Also hard mod in the SMT Nocturne does that too. Does it have New Game Plus, Nocturne? It's nothing. Trust me. Enough of this chatter. We need to get to the helm. Now. She's right. Lead on. I actually don't like when GRPGs have difficulty settings because Usually that means that you can run into into grind if you choose something more than easy, and easy is usually like laughably easy, so it's not very enjoyable Whatever to play. Comes, I'm ready. Can we equip her? No, we can't. Aggression means nothing to me. Actum does have new game plus. Also, some Japanese games like hardest difficulties they're made for New Game Plus, but you for some reason can choose it on your first game, on your first playthrough. Like that thing happened to me in uh, Resident Evil Revelations, the first one. I was like, I'm familiar with the series, I can play on a uh, on hard or normal. There was two difficulties, either easy or normal and normal or hard or normal and hard. And I chose the hardest one. Means nothing and me. turned out it was a um, it was New Game Plus difficulty. I couldn't even get through first pack of enemies. Because uh, I didn't have enough equipment to get rid of them and you couldn't dodge them. Also, you can beat Nocturne at low levels too, but it requires big brain and game knowledge. Big brain in JRPG? Usually these games like big numbers. Big dig DPS, Step. and you're good. Seems simple enough. You just grind if you if you can't get somewhere. Did I open it? I think I did. You can, you can go. We are nearing the helm. Once inside, do as I say. Who put you in charge? I'll trust my own judgment. Kane Yank. All right, we're almost out of tutorial. <laughs> Took me <laughs> almost an hour to create a character and get through tutorial. Anyway. Be gone, demons. Oh, demons and tentacles. Some spicy mix. Yeah, now there are some tier runs with only required battles, so that means only bosses, that means, in other words, 
almost no fusion, low level, and she just heals for most of the time. Do it. We will deal with the Geich after we escape. Connect the nerves. Nerves. We will connect them. The runs with only required battles. You mean it's like a any person speedrun? Or is something different? Don't underestimate buffs. Oh man, buffs and debuffs in... Uh, I'm not sure about SMT games, but in Persona games are very freaking important. When I go. And elemental vulnerabilities, of course, as well. Should we go hard on damage or not so much? Cutting bolt should melt these guys. Demons. 75%. With my luck, we're gonna miss. Look at this. <laughs> Called it. Boss and Divas are your best friend. They can turn the whole battle in your favor. True. The faith. Let's shield someone weaker. Imagine the importance Persona puts on buffs and debuffs and double that in some Nocturne buffing is half the battle. And isn't it good? Like... Sometimes buffs are not very important in some games, like... Like most of the Final Fantasy games... Except maybe for uh, 10... FF10 debuffs were very freaking important. Should I attack? Not this guy. I can try to check out Fairy Fire. No, let's try this thing. And hit this guy with a staff. Yeah, 95%. Hopefully, we will not miss. And Dragon Quest games usually. In Dragon Quest games, debuffs are very important as well. These games are freaking grindy. Especially older ones with the job systems. I could use dash. Let's forget about dash. I should use it more often. I just need to reach this control panel in here. Tackle some tentacles and get out. Let's just pummel and smack him with a sword. Let's go. Easy. My combat goes so smooth in this playthrough. Didn't think it was like that with the, with the paladin. Maybe I'm just luckier with we need the rolls. Eat this filthy casual. One HP, damn it. Come on, can't stay idle. Let's finish this guy. Mistake. Great battle is going on. Can we loot? I think we can loot only with the main character. Be true. We could use dash as well. If this ship hits the ground, we're dead. Yeah, yeah, we know. Almost out. I have to keep going. Before they strike. Well, so much for peace. Another crossbow. Not this guy. 
MT, another crossbow. Something good here, I hope. We fight them. Ooh, nice shot. I did not expect this. How many turns do we have for this debuff? Why doesn't it... I think it's still on, but I don't see... Buff. Anyway. Just move forward. No, she can't move. Okay. I guess I didn't finish the turn this time. Come on, little brain, show them who's the boss. Time to strike. On the move. I think we shouldn't worry about this guy. Little brain will tank them. Heading there. Time to strike. Damage. I will not know failure. Time to push my luck again. Forward is taken. And we're almost out. Dash probably. These boots have seen everything. The Helm's alien transponder. You made it in time. Yay! It's straight out from uh, Avatar. The camera and stuff. Need this dragon later. Probably wouldn't have to fight him. In the previous time, I talked my way out. Not sure if I will manage to do that with this character. Just so good at this. Are we missing music? I think we're uh, supposed to have some music in here, but. And. We are out of the tutorial. Finally, it took me an hour <laughs> to create a character and complete the tutorial. Even if it was a almost a smooth ride, except for a Shadow Heart stuff. I didn't manage to get her out in the first try. Lizelle had to finish the business. Away for a bit and back. Well, welcome back. You didn't really miss that much. Just just finished the tutorial. Did you beat the game or something? What? You mean beat? Feel like finish? No, it, it's just the start. Though I finished uh, early access a day or two ago. It is just the beginning. Now the beginning is very 
very epic, kind of hooks you. I think they did a good job with uh, the prologue or a tutorial part and uh, the whole world access feels pretty nice. It even has some kind of an ending to it, which feels like an ending to a game or a part of it. I can't wait to see what what awaits us in the full version of the game. One piece. All right. Can't slow down. Can you open this clam? Rope throw? Nope. Fresh water. There must be a settlement somewhere nearby. That's a good conclusion. There are a few settlements, but not all of them are friendly, unfortunately. Fish for a camp. And a body of Shadowheart, probably dead. Let's loot her. Wake her reached for the artifact or leave. <laughs> Let's leave her here, she'll be fine. Mm. You're alive. I'm alive. How is this possible? Apparently we are special. Doesn't matter, we made it. True. Seems like we're the lucky ones, judging by all the corpses strewn about. I remember the ship. I remember falling. Then nothing. Will she die if you will not let her out of this uh, thing she was trapped in? This cage? Uh, first what? things first. We need supplies, shelter, and most of all, a healer. We might have escaped, but we still have these little monsters in our heads. I would better moving then, farewell. We want to stay together? We need each other, and we both know what's at stake. I can't think of better company. All right, let's get moving. One thing, just before we go. I wanted to thank you again for freeing me. It would have been all too easy for you to run right past my pod, but you didn't. I'll remember that. Well, technically not we did, did it, but Lazel, but whatever. Can we change her equipment now? Wits and blades yes, we can. Let's give her a crossbow does she have a shield she does I've got a long road ahead I'm ready. what else can we Whatever do here I guess not much we can send it to camp we don't need to carry all this food with us hi I'm back welcome back my Did you have some great battle in Bannerlord? But that'll fill my pack. I guess we'll beat some some brains soon and get level two, which is big for a druid. As we'll choose our subclass and Not we'll be able to turn in into end. animals. Hmm. Wouldn't wish that fate on anyone. Oops. Wonder if you have any secrets around I have missed the first time. Now I went to get some fries. Oh. I guess enjoy your fries.
something good. We'll find a teleport here. Yeah, there it is. Can we open this door though at this point? Loot. Some tools. Some useful stuff in these boxes. This door now. Can't get that open, Can you see? break it? Maybe there's another entrance. Can Shadowheart break it? Not with the crossbow, silly. Ah. Can't give up now. No way. Need to find a way forward. I'm not sure why I pick up all this grass, cause. I didn't find a good use for them in my previous playthrough. I think there's only one potion we can craft. No traps, please. Some kind of antidote potion. Alright, it's gonna be our, our battle. Not the first one, but we have only two characters. Be quiet. Move with care. More of those wretched things. We can get our Don't ass kicked. Can we attack them? Did you scare them or something? I think they were hostile to me previously. They don't look very hostile now though. Just out of view. Oh my oh, now are they? Are they hostile? Everything. Are they not hostile? So confused. No, we can attack them, definitely. Let's start with this one. On. Sneak up and hit him with a stick. Better stay back. One strike could be lethal. Buff. Smack him. Two more to go. Surprised! They're surprised! Will something explode if I will use the firebolt? Darkness, take care, you need. It will! Okay, that's good. For a dull moment. Didn't pull too far, unfortunately, but I think it's enough to pull someone off the ledge, which is big because fall damage is not a joke in here. Man, I didn't get one one HP worth of damage yet in this game, in this playthrough. Man, it was so easy. Circle of the Moon. That's what I wanted. What do we get? Some hit points, some level 1 spell slots. Um, Lunar Mant. Spend spell slots to regain hit points while in wild shape. I guess it's healing when we use animal shapes. Here they are. I think it's a wolf shape. Though it says just wild, wild shape. It's badger, spider, wolf. I guess it's a general ability and those are shapes we will choose. Cat and a bear. A bear is like exclusive to Circle of the Moon Druid. That's a power spell, like wow. It's a powerful, power spe <laughs> powerful spell. Did you play WoW? Or you're just, <laughs> you're just surprised. Gotta go by. Well, thanks for being here. Enjoy your evening. A bit confused. It looks good enough. I believe we will have 
speak with the animal when we are in animal form, so we don't really need the spell that much. Alright. I guess we can go and get Astorian. Repair. We are not proficient. Force. Mind Flayer. Have to keep going. What's inside? Potion of Speed. They're kinda rare and we got two already at the very start of the game. And they're pretty good. Like my paladin could attack three times in a row if he drinks one. On level five. Another one, damn it. Are they always here or do they just random? Stacking objects. Are they trying to wink on some uh, hidden item? Because there are some items that are like hidden underneath stuff. I remember someone in chat told me to move a stone, and turned out beneath the stone there is a there was an amulet. So I kind of need to look for these things. To be fair, I think we need to roll perception on this stone first, so it's like... Characters also needs to be... need, need to be... careful to look at stuff. Alright, let's get a stair in first and then try to... Unlock this box. There he is. What's up for discussion? Hurry. I've got one of those brain things cornered. There, in the grass. You can kill it, can't you? Like you killed the others? Oh, he watched us killing stuff. Kill yourself, you look capable enough. I was hoping for a kind soul. Well, not to worry. So there's no way to get out of this situation. <laughs> Dexterity. Quickly roll away. He's holding us with a knife in his hand, like... But let's try it anyway. <laughs> Why not? Twenty, natural twenty, easy. I saw you on the ship, strutting about whilst I was trapped in that pod. What did you and those tentacled freaks do to me? Can we see him on the on the ship as well? I've never noticed him. Put the knife away and maybe we can talk. You'll talk. I can... Ah! Your mind twists. You're looking out of unfamiliar eyes, prowling dark, busy streets. You try to hold the memory, but it fades to the worm. The light. The fear. <sighs> what was that? What's going on? I don't know, but something just connected us. It's those tentacled monsters. Whatever they did to us caused that link. It's destiny. They took you too. Apparently. I saw it during whatever just happened. And to think, I was ready to decorate the ground with your innards. <laughs> Apologies. I probably just accepted I might have done the same where the roles reversed. Uh -huh. A kindred spirit. My name's Astarian. 
I was in Baldur's Gate when those beasts snatched me. Wait, are we Baldurian anyway? Doesn't matter which backstory we choose. Because our backstory is Outlander. How the hell are we Baldurians? Those races in Baldur's Gate know the city well, for better or worse. That's weird. Like, what is the point to... to highlight it that it's Baldurian if it's gonna be available all the time? Or is like that on the inner axis? Is that so? We clearly move in different circles. So, do you know anything about these worms? Turn us into... <laughs> of course it'll turn me into a monster. What else did I expect? You already won, I shouldn't worry Although, about it too much. It hasn't happened yet. If we can find an expert, someone that can control these things, there might still be time. Is there a way to know that he's a vampire earlier? What if we will feed him some garlic, I don't know, forcefully? <laughs> Control it, we need to get rid of it. Well, yes, of course. But first things first. I should travel with me. You know... I was ready to go this alone, but maybe sticking with the herd isn't such a bad idea. And you seem like a useful person to know. All right, I accept. Lead on. Was he naked there for a second? And I forgot oh, to level up Shadowheart. I don't think I ever used create or destroy water. And never used command as well. Your wounds is a good stuff, kinda. Faith. Ah, uh, let's go like that, probably. Maybe get cure wounds though. How many concentration spells do we have? Oh, only two. Anyway, let's go like that for now. I don't think duplicity ever worked too well for me. It's not, it's not the greatest spell. And just, just hit points and Class features, though those are like general stuff, but whatever. No time to rest. All right. Wonder Let's go back and open me. this this chest or crate or whatever it is. And what happens with the? Oh, there he is, the boar. Can we talk to him? <laughs> Animal handling. Should have a good roll for this. Easy enough. The ball grunts and eyes you warily with its beady eyes. The ball shuffles its trotters, unsure. Then it dashes away into the wilderness. And disappears into thin air. Magical boar. Oh, this place. I remember I didn't find it. Can we jump here? Like, I didn't find it first time I was in here as a paladin. Badly done. Hello there. Welcome to the stream. Shadowheart seemingly loves animals and hates people. I didn't notice it about her actually in the in the previous playthrough. I don't think she hates people, she just doesn't really like to be around them. Um 
Can someone move hmm. stone? Nope. Yeah, my pilot paladin could move this in the previous playthrough, but maybe shove it. Nope. She likes when you pet dogs, she likes when you pacify the boar, she likes when you lie to people. I think when I was doing uh, good stuff to people, she and Gale usually liked it, and Asterion didn't like. So I'm, I'm not sure about, like, lie to people. Well, I guess lying it's not... Not doing good stuff for people. So maybe she doesn't mind to do good stuff. I think I should pay more attention to it. A good observation. I didn't notice it before. What now? What about vampire? Can you move it? No. Lazy little. No one back home will ever believe this. All right. Anyway, let's, let's continue. Everything. Now let's go and get Gale. <clears throat> I should use wild shape. Would the bear move the stone? Now we can find this half dead mind flare in here. I think previous time I smashed his skull. As a paladin, let's see what we can do as a druid in here. Um he's not here. What? Interesting. Okay. Why is he not here then? Or why he was here before? In the previous playthrough, let's... I don't get it. Maybe we need to get the Gale first. Over there. Worth checking for supplies, maybe. Yeah, yeah, that's what we do. Now let's see if Estern has that. any... He has a bow, let's give him a crossbow instead. Probably a second dagger or a peer. I guess I will level him up into... ...to do a builder again. Keep your distance, darling. Can he use a dagger? Nope. Not before we get this uh, Have a lot on my mind. feet or whatever is called in here. In it. Moving ahead. Wool wielding. You're alive. That's unexpected. Last I saw you, you were lying in a crucible's worth of blood. An intellect devourer nibbling at your ear. Glad to see my eyes deceive me. I'm Gale. Well met. Well met, you were in the ship as well, I presume. Can you actually see them, him and the stair on the ship? The very same. A traumatizing experience, if an instructive one. Destructive, what makes you say that? Nautiloids are incredibly rare vessels, a mind flare colony's most guarded secret, and a gift pack's greatest prize. Not to mention, you're staring at me like a Rashimi at a blackboard. You're no wizard, are you? Maybe a bit. No, I'm not a wizard. Hmm, pity. But that'll have to wait. The primary need now is a healer. I take it you recall the insertion of the parasite? I recall it, yes, vividly. Are you aware that after a Such period a of excruciating gestation, it'll turn us into mind flayers? A 
process known as ceramorphosis? It is to be avoided. I assume you're no accomplished healer either. Powerful cleric, maybe? A druid. I can tend to basic wounds and ailments, but I can't remove alien parasites. I wonder how people in the grove will greet us as a druid. I gather as much. We'll have to look for a solution elsewhere. You and I are in a whole lot of trouble. We need help, and I'm not sure where we'll find it in this world. I think we had similar options as Paladin as well. On the quest for a healer together? Like, we can heal, but for a bit. Not with some major stuff. It sounds like a plan. You're welcome to join me. Most excellent. Then, without further ado, let's be off. Besides, looks like you keep some interesting company. A woman with shadows for eyes. Deep as the dark lake. Pleasure, madam. Is it indeed? We'll see. He's heating on her right away. Mm. I applaud your taste. One with the weave. Uh, what did it choose previously? I think this one. Abjuration. What's the difference there? Half the cost to learn navigation spells from spell scrolls. Learning these spells will only cost 25 gold per spell level. I actually didn't learn one spell like that in the previous playthrough. And I was complaining that Gale is not that good until level 5 or so. Sculpt spells. Create pockets of safety within your vacation spells. So let's automatically succeed at saving throws and take no damage from these spells. Yeah, I think this one I used. Let's try vacation this time. Chosen spells. Feather fall. It's kind of useful a couple of times, but don't need it all the time. Rev sickness. A false life. That could be good. I had a, quite a few scrolls of this spell, and that was that was okay. Expeditious retreat gain dash as a bonus action, allowing you to move at an incredible speed, incredible pace. Don't we have Misty Stepan here instead? Poison, is poison any good? Bring hands. Jump. Jump was, could be useful this time. I didn't have strong paladin to jump around. Chromatic warp. Well, let's go like that for now. Card spells to never use grease. Maybe I should have the card of the garden and grease, slowing creatures within and possibly making them fall prone. Why didn't I use it? Sleep. Maybe I should use Grease actually. Oh, Cloud wasn't great as well. Yeah, let's try big Grease this time. I guess I didn't use it because I had a PTSD from the Vinter original scene games where battlefields are always covered in some crap. Let your character sleep on and fall prone. I guess we can go and get rid of the of the guys on uh, right here. They should be right here. The looters or marauders. I think I talked my way through previously. Let's see what we can do now. What was the troll? 
take a few risks. Well, hello. Let's hide everyone. Except for oh, this one. I don't want to think about why my eye is itching. I'll just... Either you both twice as tall as me, but I'm half the bloody backbone. But we don't know what that thing even is. And what about the crypt? I'm telling you, it's a ship. And the crypt can wait. Mari and Barton have been trying to break in for days. Now we... Stop! Got ourselves competition already. That's our ship. Competition is not gonna work this time. Not much is gonna work though, I think. Exception. The ship is full of monsters, I wouldn't go near it. Ten. We could succeed. Easy. Easy roll. Well, uh, Gale approves, Shadow Heart approves. Come on, you lot. No point in getting killed. Second worm gets the cheese and all. Um, second mouse gets the cheese, no? Nobody's getting any damn cheese. Now move it! I think they say those lines no matter what. You're more cunning than you look. I thought we had a fight on our What choice you choose to do, like what option you choose. Oh, in this place, we can drop in here, apparently. Time and the elements have left the plaque unreadable. This way. Let's not step on this, this time. Hmm. What's that? And no one have a shovel, of course. Can we go in from here? We can, but first let's see if we, can, if we have any loot in here. Though I don't want to, to fall. Oh, we can shoot this thing down. No, 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 don't move. Entangled, okay. Keep a blade close. Don't, don't stab there, damn it. So I should... It's loose. One could push away from tumbling. Damn. Still breathing. So we'll not Despite fall, everything. right? Right? At the ready. Like I did in the previous playthrough. <laughs> Some camp supplies. Another box here. Okay. Can you get through this door as well? So it's locked. Not sure if I want to spend spend the tools on it, though we have quite a few right now. Torch, rum. Let's keep with us. Because we may need some booze later. Or oh, garlic! Can we feed a stair and some garlic? I wanna try it. And also give him all my tools. There you go. Is this stuff one handed or two handed? Oh, it's one handed apparently. I didn't know that. Why didn't I give Gale any shields before? I get lower damage then. Well, we're not gonna hit with it anyway. Like, is gonna cast most likely. My character is going to be in a animal form anyway. So. Let's try this. Will I stay and eat a garlic? Can he eat it? No, oh, there's no way to feed it to him, damn it. Damn it. Is that blood? No, 
Never mind. All right, let's try other way. If not over, then through. Let's try to get inside through the hedge. <clears throat> oh, it's locked as well. Sterion, no get to work. <laughs> Easy. Easy? It's 20, damn it. Something tells me we'll lose <laughs> our tool. Let's try the door pro. Nah, let's roll. Yeah. We try again. What about the door? Maybe the door is easier. Easier to open. Need to get a shower somewhere. A quick rummage. Also, we could just jump inside through this hole, but have to fight. I think we'll have to fight anyway. Ah, just seven. So not many tools. Maybe, maybe just now. Nah, let's go through the hole. Never a dull moment. Let's On go through way. the hole. Yeah. See anything? Whoops. Oh. Ooh, I have a plan. Have this spell. Yeah, let's go. Damn, it looked beautiful. Now let's turn into a bear. Hell yeah, but look at this polar bear. Dismiss wild shape. You have assumed the shape of a bear, of a beast. You can use the dismiss wild shape action to return to your normal form. Okay. For now I think we'll just, just hide. Can you attack? No. Let's walk a bit back. Oh you moron. Eat the poor bear. In the butt. We need to explode this barrel. Like real bad. Shadowheart, are you okay? Can you hit the barrel? Hell yeah! That was beautiful. This guy's still alive somehow. This fight went so good. There's just no way to hit him. My character doesn't feel that good. Can you reach him? No. Just hide, I guess. Shadowheart will heal you. Can we get him without damage? Try me. Damn it. Well, one spell slot. I don't think we need to be healed. Sixty, fifty, 
fine to shoot him. Feel my mistress's wrath. Easy. Let's get going. Let's heal up first. Oh damn it, someone's burning. I must keep going. Shell heart is burning apparently. It was dumb of you, Shell Heart. Take kill you. All's well that ends. That was a beautiful fight. Just exploded everyone. This bed is giant. Beautiful. Leather armor. I guess we're not very good at stealth in this form. Let's have a look. And the animations are kinda kinda cute. Yeah, look at this bear. Looks like a polar bear, but not really. The head is different. Move the mirror. So there's not much loot in this room, unfortunately. It's cold, of burning hands. More books we can sell. Great club. Is it two handed? It is. No one will use it, most likely. Leather boots. Leather gloves. Who's missing gloves? Let's see what the day brings. Staren does. So that's progress. Give some potion to uh, poison to Shadow Heart as well. And some trash weapons. Alright, I think here we will explore some. Explore the ruins. Yeah, we will explore the ruins this way, and there's another fight behind this door. Softer than a whisper. A bear in stealth. Look at him. Completely invisible. Alright, let's open this door. Everyone, quiet. Let's go. Look at this. Almost solid snake. Oh, you bastard! Let's have some fun. What skills do we have? Goading roar. A roar at nearby enemies. To goad them into attacking you. Oh, it's like a, a tank stance almost. I can heal up a bit, but we will not do it. Let's just attack. And miss. Okay, I've just seen this companion right now, and I already think it's the best one in the game, even though my knowledge of the game can be described as jack shit. And what companion? I don't really get what you're talking about. Like from companions I have... Shadowheart is a, your basic cleric. She's not very great at combat, but she heals. That's good. Asterion, I leveled him up into pure physical damage previous, in the previous playthrough. The bear. Oh, it's not a companion, it's my character druid. You can turn into, into a bear, apparently. And there are some other animals. There is a wolf, a badger, a raven, a spider, a cat. 
someone else some giant bull. Damn, this guy is strong actually, kinda. There's a lot of movement. Oh, and I thought it was a bear and I'm sad. Well, it is a bear, it's just... There's a human inside, somewhere, somewhere deep inside. And he can be stealthy. But he makes a lot of sound. My face protects me. All right. What now? I wonder if you can talk to people through from Another this form. I think I need to get a key from this guy first. It's been a long day. Better stop to rest soon. No resting. Do I need bottles? I don't think so. Uh, what else? A lot of food to loot, some cedarware. Oh yeah, let's go. And camp supplies. I really want to get them. I don't think so, we can skip it. We can't skip this one though. Wine is good to have, cheese is good to yes, have. Dale. It's been centuries since any prayers disturbed it. And that's Who are those it. Prayers for? I'm not going to be a loot hoarder this time because you don't really need to get that much food. Oh, wait a second, we can sit in a bear form. What's on your mind? What happened? Oh, is that because it's clicked? Oh, we're back. I guess we can talk to people, it's fine. But my bear is not. Yeah. Let's try to see it. Hell yeah. Look at this good boy. <laughs> Imagine having such a pet at home. Quietly sitting in a corner. Do I really need this cauldron? I think so. I remember looting this place for a while in the first playthrough. Don't even know what, what I was taking. <laughs> it's full of trash. <laughs> Can a bear read this? Shall I hurt you? Ancient, indecipherable text covers the plaque. A dead tongue. Whoever worshipped here must be long gone. Okay. Right, I think... I actually don't remember where does this door lead. Outside. Okay. Oh, someone have followed Cozen de Grey. Sorry I have butchered it. Thanks for the follow, I really appreciate it. I don't remember this door. I think it's some kind of a storage room. Again. Do we have a key? No lock, no handle. How does it open? Oh, I think we need to... Wish to live in more interesting times. Eve stools, how did I miss What's them? I think we need to press some switch. Probably from here. Or from here, oh, maybe. Way. I think I opened this door before somehow. Yeah, maybe we'll figure it out later. I think there's some switch somewhere, somewhere in this place. I remember there was a a green spear we could find, but we need to be careful because this place is full of traps. Yeah, everything is gonna explode. Oh no, it's not here, it's a bit later. 
can sell these books. They they're not very expensive, but still, it's some money for start. I actually had a lot of money at the end of the previous playthrough. I guess we shouldn't really worry about it. But I'm a loot hoarder. I have a severe case of FOMO. So you do not recognize the language on the plaque. Someone does? You do not recognize no. the language Gale, on the plaque. please. You do not recognize the okay, language okay, we on got the it. plaque. Some records of people dying from drowning, from internal rot, from fever. Best be on my way. I guess so. Um, oh yeah, lever, there, there it is. We opened the door. We have seen before that. Candles, is there any use for these candles? Didn't find it in, in the previous playthrough. There's a lot of items that are obscure to me, like why are they even in the game just for for entourage, for setting? But there are, there are actually use cases for them. No idea. It's quite a library. Yeah, here we can go go deeper. Yeah, I remember this place. And some cheap silverware. Oh, I like it. Homely. Homely? Maybe for a vampire, not for normal people though. Torch, a ring. Yeah, we'll stand on the Asterion inside. Everyone else will stay outside. Because this room is... One step at a time. It's full of explosives. Oops, that's already bad. Shadowheart, help us. Trap. Yeah. Gas piece. Beware of gas piece which spew first surfaces of clouds. Cover them with sufficiently heavy objects. I think I've tried to do that before, but did not didn't manage. It did not end well. I think we can find some some buttons on those pillars as well. So cool. I prefer gold, not it. Damn it, another perception fail. Sterian, you're supposed to be good at this. Careful, I bind. How did they find buttons in the previous playthrough? Be careful. There are traps. Oh, this thing. Yeah. We have to be very damn careful in here. Yes, let's. Anything here? A trap. Okay. Someone doesn't like visitors. A sword. Exception failed. Okay. Damn it. I am ready. Let's try this way. What's happening with this guy today? Usually good at this. 
Best avoid that trap. But in what it does, does it turn it on or off? I don't remember. Looks like a trap then. Alright, let's save. Because I think I'm going to screw it up. And nothing. How thrilling. I want to open this door. Oh dear. Someone's oh, left a trap out for us. There was some something here as well. Need to keep going. That's bad. All right, let's send Shadowheart here. Everyone else, and Asterion will try to do his magic in here. Go. Maybe we can turn it off. Actually, take it. Click. Are we good? I think we are. I wasn't smart enough to do that in the previous time. Um, oh, I think they're gonna shoot now. Let's see. Sterian? Oh, I could get used to this. Now we can get out from here again. Moving. That was fine. I thought it's gonna be worse. Where does this door lead? I don't remember. Should be easy. Fifteen. Let's get everyone else here. All right. What now? Very well. So we got a spear that I'm not gonna use because I believe no one is proficient enough with it. <sighs> Everything looks new. With pleasure. Guidance, let's go. I think it's not enough. It depends on guidance. Yeah, not enough. This will spend another lockpick. Have we got an inspiration from Cursed Coin? No time to rest. Oh, it's just. Okay, didn't worth it, really. What was it sound? Moving ahead. All right, now now this part of a crypt. Shed stash. Okay. It's exactly the same mechanic as in um, Divinity Original Sin. Oh, those guys. I remember those bastards. So I remember. I remember. was so subversive about their words that they commanded protection. Probably want to have a short rest. I believe this is just a dead end. There's nothing to see. I remember I did not manage to get through this fight in the first playthrough, but I wasn't really ready to fight. Characters were tired, I didn't have too many spell slots, and so on. I kind of want to try to do it now. Jurgle. I didn't think anyone worshipped the scribe of the dead. My faith will guide me. The inscription is in a language unknown to you. Is it possible that some character will know this language or it's always going to be unknown? Open up. Scimitar. I believe druids are proficient with scimitars. So maybe we could try to use it. But there's no real reason to do so, because I think I'm going to be in animal forms all the time. Here's the button we need. Anything of use? Yeah. 
think we need more light in this place. Probably it will help in combat. Though most of the characters have dark vision. And here we will find a, a book. Book of Dead Gods. I don't remember what I did with it in a previous playthrough. I think I just chained up book in a long abandoned temple. Ooh, temptation, my friend. We meet again. I think you just checked it out and that's it. Took with us. Haven't done much later. Let's take this a look. This book is far lighter than it should be with such a massive lock. I thought it would turn into in the human strength smash the lock open who's four from strength i think base strength of the character is eight we wouldn't have any like any proficiency on the strength roll but since we are in the bear mode so we're kind of strong guys now easy roll Weird cutscene. As the lock opens, a though. loose page comes with it. Magic pulses from the parchment. What was once script is now an obliterated scrawl. You have a sense these are names, a list. But of what? Religion. It's a very religious bear. Examine the book more closely. It's an easy roll. Yeah. Let's go. Gods. These are the names of gods. Once lost, but now restored after the second sundering. Shadowheart liked it for the some reason. The three names in this book sit close together, but are so devastated by the scroll as to be unreadable. Entire pantheons have dwindled and been reborn, silently recorded by this book. All right. Gears inspired. Let's grab it with us. Why not? All right, now let's try to get rid of these dead guys. We'll make them even more dead. I would even say deader. Probably will put everyone in stealth, unchain, and bear will go somewhere here. What path lies before me? Yeah, sneaking, very sneaky bear. Hello, you. Staren will go. Probably somewhere here. They will try to kill this guy together with Gale. Such an undignified position to find oneself in. Please. Gale will try to offer support. Probably from somewhere... Somewhere here? No, 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 no here, here. And Shadowheart will this. press the button. Nice and Where's my sneaky bear? Alright, I think we're good. Mm. Oh, Gale should use his uh, magical web, uh, magical armor. I always forget about it. Yeah, let's go. If I must. All right. I need to come now we're good. Let's get started. Do you press it? Click. Now the dead have risen. Scary. Trying to frighten me with cheap tricks. Darkness is one down. <laughs> Good start. Now oh, damn it. Was Gil in stealth? 
All right, Gil was hit. I can't afford to fail. Oh, Shadowheart is uh, not uncovered yet. You can use her to strike in the back. This guy. Let's go. I think our plan plan works out pretty damn well so far. We have killed one guy already. Bear is gonna tank some damage. Shadowheart is gonna join the fray right now. Yeah, good start. Can we kill this guy? You can. Good job. Now hide. Over here. Damn it, that's a lot of damage. Alright, this guy. Probably necrotic damage is not the best thing to do in here. Just bless, maybe? Oh, it was... It's not a bonus action. Oh well. I'm fine with that. And they do a lot of damage. Weakening strike. Or flourish. Let's try flourish on this guy. Damn it. Hmm. Kale, what can you offer to us? I need one shot like this guy. Please do. Damn it. Doesn't look like a one shot to me. I don't want to spend any potions in here. Probably I should. He's gonna move. This guy's going to move. This guy is going to move, damn it. Someone is gonna die in here. Alright. Probably this guy is going to die. Let's go. Hell yeah. Let's heal up. Um. That's not the greatest heal. Not the greatest. Uh, no healing. Oh yeah, I ran out of spells. Damn it, I shouldn't have used Bless. Alright. He's dazed. And there's another guy. Spill some blood. Potion or no potion? Gale could try to finish this guy. Allow me to demonstrate. Nemesis. Alright. Nice job, Gale. Now finish him. Take me yet. And probably heal. That's a bonus action. We can heal each turn, but it doesn't heal that much. Very well. Fortunately. Right. What about this dude? Just smash him in the head. And miss, of course. Shall we cut and run? Sixty-five. Ooh, nice damage. What fools these mortals be! Okay, prone. Good. 
Maybe I should have done that first and then try to hit him. But yet, yeah, wasted opportunity. At the ready. Um, are you moving? Man, he's tanky. Tanky as hell. Not enough movement, seriously. No. No one stopped me yet. One day I'll catch All right, back. I've managed somehow. Did not expect this. I think on the previous playthrough I've beaten those guys when I've leveled up to level uh, three at least, maybe four. Sorry, bones guarding dusty trinkets. Pathetic. They're mod monsters. I wouldn't give them a second thought. Fair enough. But you never know when you might become one yourself. Move. All's well that ends. Not as bad as it could have. I guess it's some kind of a bug. After transformation, character doesn't move. Open up. I have to click on him. Again. I guess they have no loot. I've looted them before that already. Alright, let's see what we have inside. Lot of effort to hide one sarcophagus. Speak with the dead. Do we need it right now? I don't remember. I think we don't. The guy we are gonna find in here is not really dead. No, let's equip Emily just in case. Can we do it? We can't. We are bare, I guess. Uh, can't really do anything. This is going to shadow heart. All right, let's open it. As a paladin, it was an easy dialogue. Let's see how Druid is going to fare. I can trade with him. I don't have any money now. We have a lot of crap to sell. So he has spoken, and so thou standest before me, right as always. What a curious way to awaken. Now, I have a question for thee. What is the worth of a single mortal's life? Oh, we don't have a druid option here. Interesting. I think we had a paladin option. Not a druid one. Quite the question. What is the reason for it? Curiosity. Nothing more. Wilt thou answer my question? Yes, ask away. Or we should sell him our crab first, though. Let's leave the scimitar. Rings, scrap. I guess I don't need the books as well. Let's go. Who else wearing some user stuff? 
I never use this stuff. This. Someone else had some weapons. Barter? I have one scroll from somewhere. Where did I get it? Should we get another one? Let's barter and let's sell him some more stuff. Hell yeah, here we go. Shadowheart has two scrolls from somewhere. The hell? I don't remember it. Alright, I think we're good. Yes, ask away. So, I ask again. What is the worth of a single mortal life? Um... It depends on the mortal. I am curious by what standards thou shalt judge. Very well. I am satisfied. This guy is so easy to satisfy. <laughs> we have met, and I know thy face. We will see each other again at the proper time and place. Farewell. That's such a weird way to add a resurrection guy to your camp. Like, I think he's pretty damn easy to miss. Here lies the guardian of tombs. Through knowledge comes atonement. What if you don't find this button? What if you don't get this guy? You don't have... Parchment and bone dust. You're just unable to resurrect your guys? Still comforting after all this time. Wonder what the design thought was behind it. I think we explored everything in here. We can just get out. So now we can go and save Lizael or Lazel, whatever her name is. And go to Druid Grove. I'm really curious how druids are going to react to us. The text on the plaque is a mystery to you. Breathe deep and move. Maybe I should have used another way out, but we can check if I've skipped anything in here. Oh, we also need to check on the dead Mind Flayer. Or half dead. Like in the first playthrough, I found here a... an injured Mind Flayer. And this time he wasn't around for some reason. Let's have a look. Another potion of speed. Some good stuff. Yeah, he was here on the first playthrough. He's not here now. Wonder why. I kind of want to try to move the, the stone with the bear. Let's see if we can do this. Because the bear is fairly strong. Can we see his uh, stats? 19 strength. That's a freaking lot. I don't think you can get 19 strength for your character. And he jumps pretty far. Like my paladin. And look how gracefully he walks. Just a machine. Yeah, he can move it. Great. A ruby. I got Harper's Notebook. Collection of reports. And uh, nothing good. There's map. I guess more. 
More speed potions. Those are good. Okay. Do we have more caches mapped? Yeah, here's the one. Alright, let's get back to Lazel. How do we get there though? I think here. Need to use this in this next fight. There may be even more that survived the crash. Yeah, I think we need to go here. Yeah, we need to get a shovel somewhere. Broken. Must have been here a while. I think we can find it somewhere around this place. First, let's, let's go here. You think it's dangerous? Of oh, course, there. it's dangerous. Your skull pounds in response to the prisoner's white hot stare. Her lips don't move, yet you hear her voice. You again. Your skull briefly aches, and you are her. You feel her irritation and indignity. And you feel answers. She knows more about your condition. Get rid of them. Oh, wait. Didn't I just talk to them previously? I think I just talked to these guys before. I have to kill them. Or maybe I didn't. Anyway, let's just let's get straight to business. Right. Can you feel death's cold grip? You feel her now. Can we stab this guy. Can we shove him? It is bonus. It is bonus action. Let's let's stab Dude. him first and then, then shove. <laughs> Didn't work. No gloom, all doom. Step to it. Okay. Now oh, he shoves as well. I wonder if you just copied my actions or... No, we can, yeah, do some tanking. But I want to do more damage instead. What do I have to lose? Damn it. Should've tanked. And we have no healing anymore because no slow spells. Join the fight. On my way. Time to kill. Sounds like flourish this guy. <laughs> nice damage. The witching hour. Damn it, Kale. Oh. No. Last damage. Light on my feet. <laughs> they hate Gale, apparently. Got to move. Give them good shots. Let's spill some blood. Oh, 
Yeah, I just hit her. At least Good damage again. The tadpole hasn't yet scrambled all your senses. Auspicious. But the longer we wait, the more it consumes. My people possess the cure for this infection. I must find a crash. You will join me. We can't find the crash. It's not available in early access. Let's go. And what exactly is Krish? Now join me then, but I'll watch you. I'll be watching you closely. You do not have the authority. Defer to your leader. Oh, really? Why do you even talk to her then? To speak. You are unable to speak. Oh. Okay. Can't slow down. The tadpole hasn't yet scrambled all your senses. Auspicious. But the longer we wait, the more it consumes. My people possess the cure for this infection. I must find a crash. You will join me. Careful. She obviously sees your kindness as weakness. Don't let her take advantage. All right, we're joining together. Let's find this creche. You are full up. Dismiss your weakest warrior. No, I mean, go to my camp. Wait, to my camp. Yeah. Very well, but heed my words. I think I will use the, the same composition as before. Camp. One there, this Zoru, has seen Githyanki. A crash must be near. I must interrogate this Zoru. Our very lives depend on it. I will be at your camp. Do not keep me waiting. Oh yeah, we have seen these guys in the previous playthrough. No traps, please. And um, yeah, let's take a short rest. Oh, we have no short rests. Still alive, so that's progress. All right. I think we can find a shell right, like real close to this place. Somewhere here, probably. Oh, here, yeah. Hmm. No healing. Looking ahead. Let's get a shovel. Dig. Have to keep going. To keep digging spots we know about. And after that, use a long rest. I hear shouting up ahead. We should check it out, but be careful. Let's go. So now we need to go somewhere here. I wonder if this guy stacked me right away because it was in a bear form. Because I think I didn't kill this two in the first playthrough. I just stole them to piss off and they disappeared. Here's our digging spot. Another treasure. You know what? That is not the easiest of questions for me to answer. You mean just waiting? Like a lovesick puppy? Short term amusements are much less hassle. Some gold, another scroll. Yeah, let's take a long rest now. This seems as good a place as any to make camp. I don't remember first time making camp. And here's our new guy, the trader. Now let's talk first. Mm, I want to have a word. A monster forms inside us, and you think to be idle. I knew your kind to be fragile. But I didn't foresee the severity. 
Be quick about your rest. We must locate a crash. Will she talk to us differently if we will also play Githyanki? Or it doesn't really change? We need to pace ourselves, don't you know? An exhausted warrior is an ineffective one. I don't think she'll like it. This Krish notion of yours, are you sure it's our only option? You would doubt me. I do not trust a common healer to extract a gay tadpole without killing its host. At a crash, a gustil may cleanse us safely. Take your rest. I will stand watch. Should a single tentacle split your skull, I will not hesitate to end you. Good to know. Your gith friend seems on edge. Mustn't relish the thought of sprouting tentacles. Understandable. Can't say I'm a fan either. It's just hard to join in when all of this feels so new. The night normally means bustling streets, bursting taverns. I actually could try to use Curling wheel this time in the party. Is, um, a little novel. Instead of who? Uh, a druid option. The red herbs can make a soothing tea if you can settle in. Ah, uh, no. You tea can't isn't settle really in. My drink. I'll be awake a while anyway. I need some time to think things through, to process this. You sleep. I'll keep watch. So two people keep, keep watch already. I guess thank you, I'll sleep better for that. The pleasure is all mine. Sweet dreams. I don't remember this cutscene. Go to hell. Watch your damn mouth. Ha! <laughs> You're a good sport. Go to hell. An everyday expression. So trivial it's almost meaningless. But we've seen hell. It's real. And it isn't trivial. Watch the flames in silence. Devils. Dragons. Mind flayers. They used to be abstracts, pictures on a piece of paper. I think now I remember What it. a difference a day makes. Now we have tadpoles slithering through our heads like carnivorous feti. That's not abstract. Perhaps you should get some rest. This ballet of flames invites reflection. But you're right. Let's be up with the lark. Find a healer before the wee one gets hungry. The wee one. Why it's so hard now? This canvas actually looks smaller. Then at the end of my Paladin playthrough, I guess to get upgraded with time. Or at least more stuff is gonna get here. Doing the rounds, are you? You'd better get some rest. What were you two talking about? We were just discussing our next steps. I see. I'd be careful with Lazel. I wasn't confiding in anyone. I was just talking. So am I. If we're to survive, we need to trust each other. You seem reliable. I think you know how important it is that we find someone who can cure us. Best if we focus on that.
Agreed. The sooner we find someone to help us, the better. Good. We might even get Lizelle lucky and disapproves. find one right away. Well, guess about As her. I see it, we're overdue some good fortune. Rest well. All right. Let's get some food and and rest. Give it a shot. Oh man. Wait a second. Why do I have so many with me? Send it to camp here. Yeah, should work like that. Let's go. Where are you? Oh, here we go. The demon. It's gonna try to seduce us in our sleep. You know what I oh, wait, really no demon? miss about Baldur's Gate? Okay. The food, freshest fish I've ever had. I don't care for fish. Red meat. Now, that's a different matter. Rare as can be. Dripping. This dialogues, this voice oh, acting. Unless we find a cure, you won't have any teeth to chew it with soon enough. This game is voiced pretty damn well. Alright, let's make our way to the Druid Grove and see how these Druids are going to greet fellow Druids. Let's try to climb here. Nobody gets in! Zevlor's orders! That pack of goblins will be on us any second! What's going on? Goblins are on our tail! Open the gate, Zevlor, now! You let goblins here? Where is the druid? I'm here. Please! There's no time! The nine hells! Open the gates! Why were they waiting for so long? Like, there was no space to get for them. Anyway. Oh, here's the goblin. Right, right with us. Can we shove him? Apparently we can. Alright, it's shove It's a bonus action, but I need bonus action to turn into a bear. Let's use fairy fire. On this band. Let's go. Um, didn't work too well. Just bare form. Here we are. Yeah, sound effects are a bit scuffed. Can we attack? No. Can't do anything. Let's try to sneak through, maybe, or maybe not. Now let's just wait. Ah! 
Make it hurt. Ooh, nice damage. Can we show him? Not gonna fly anywhere though. Let's try it anyway. Yeah. Magic can we use? We can try this thing. We need to get close to this guy first. Certainly. Um. How does it work? Ah. Oh, I guess it's not what I was thinking. Okay. This thing needs to ignite stuff like oil or barrels, I guess. But, uh, most likely oil or grease. No escaping the blade. Kind of a wasted turn. It's mm. a good critical hit. Shadow Heart. Do we need healing? No, it doesn't look like it. Let's do this. Okay, hit. On I go. Scout! Get to the high ground! Shark bastards! For the absolute! What was that? Grease? Yeah, it is grease, damn it. It's bad. I get rid of this guy. I'm gonna jump out from here. Swift as my feet can carry me. Please don't fall. Damn it. At least he killed him. We have another scout. Nah. Nah, I guess we're fine. We need to get rid of those guys. Creator. Destroyer. Oh, well, I forgot to kill this guy. Damn it. Oh, we can use Grease and add them. Yeah, let's go. Oops. Oh, well, it's gonna be fine, right? Yeah, he's okay. This so beautiful. Where's the damage? Damn it. Kind of helped him instead of damaging. Also weird. One shot. Let's go. Bear power. Ooh. 
With pleasure. Another miss. Oh, critical hit. Night to kill five. Witness the power of the blade. Uh, uh, uh. What was that? What did she throw at him? Can you see it in battle log? Ramira missed Aradin. Destroyed potion of healing. Did she throw a potion at him? Does it work like that? Kinda wanna try now. So can throw potions at people and it will heal them apparently. This is a pretty cool little mechanic, I didn't know about that. that was and level one. three. Inside! All of you, more may follow! Open the gate! Open the gate. No one back home will ever believe this. Oh yeah, druid level three. Some spell slots, new spells, level two. Bark skin. Such a willing creature to toughen its skin and increase its armor class up to 16. Concentration spell though. Dark vision level 2. This one sounds good, Bark skin. Flame blade. Conjure a flaming scimitar in your hand. Ah, we don't really need it. I thought Flaming Sphere is good. Ooh, Heat Metal. Cause of metal weapon or armor to glow red hot and force the creature touching it to let go or receive disadvantage attack rolls and ability checks. Will it damage this guy in Grimforge? This giant robot, Optimus Prime? Sounds like a good spell. Duration is fine. Moonbeam. I've heard this one is decent as well, but it's like very situational. Like most of the stuff in here, to be fair. Spike growth. Share a piece of ground into hard spikes. I don't know. Alright, what spells do we. Playing spheres already here. Tangle. Let's get rid of Entangle and take. Take, take, take. Kinda wanna check out Heat Metal. But I guess it's useful only when we fight humanoid like enemies. Who uses swords and armor. Like, not good against animals. And I don't think we'll encounter too many enemies like that soon. A oh, bark skin. That's that sounds like a good spell. Okay, good. I really like Groot so far. Wits and blades always sharp. More shadow heart. More spells. It's restoration. Prayer of healing. Do we want this? We probably do. Instead of this, yeah, let's go. Eight, I don't remember using eight too much. Be fair. Looks good. <sighs> Sterion? Yeah, subclass. Previously I chose Thief and really liked it. I don't like arcane stuff on Asterion. Yeah, I think I'll keep him a thief. Just pretty damn good at this. Unlocking stuff, at disarming stuff, at scouting, at sneaking behind enemies. Must hands. Action bonus action. 
You've mastered the art of falling and gain resistance to falling damage. Okay. And game. Ripe with magic. The spell was fine. Can't say it was great, but it was okay. Acid arrow. Magic weapon. The Mr. Spell is a very good spell. So we have another flaming sphere. Yeah, let's have Miss Step. It's like a really good one. No, I don't really need it. Grease wasn't that great in this fight. Let's go like that. Still breathing, despite everything. And now loot. The gods are watching me. We looked at this guy already. No, we didn't. That's weird. I usually loot stuff real quick right during combat while everyone is dying around. Ah, oh, those damn gloves. Shouldn't wear them. I remember that. What's in here? Works are usually empty. These guys always wear two spears for some reason. Oh, this guy stopped. Let's keep some boost with us. Some light crossbow. Okay, everyone is looted. Yeah, let's go in. You're being arrested for theft. If you have what? a defense, make it now. What theft? A I guess let's give him some gold. And your problem is miraculously resolved. Easy. Damn this corrupted society. You're unable to speak. As I'm still watching, oh, man. I'm a druid in a druid grove. I, mean, I should be like greeted well. Here, you fool! We was running for our lives. You led them straight to us, and you let them take the druid too. Unbelievable! She's right. We should scrum while we can. Right. Lead the goblins here, then leave the rest of us to fight them off. You coward! What's it gonna take to shut you up, Horns? Persuasion? Oh, damn, 15. I'm gonna fail it. No. Easy roll. You're right. There's too much at stake. Worried about your precious eyes, the both of you. Enough! Squabbling is pointless. The goblins have found us. At least we agree on that. There's no point surviving these worms if we end up in a goblin stew. Let's just go. We have to find a healer. Let's look around at Fine. least. But once we have what we need, we should leave. I should speak up. Forgive that display. 
Aradin's a blowhard, but that's no cause for me to join him. Thank you for your help out there. I'm Zevlor. Well met. I should warn you, visitors are no longer welcome in this grove. This Whatever your business, good. I'd see to it quickly. The druids are forcing everyone out. This attack will only strengthen their resolve. Wait a second, let's see what we can sell. What is this sound? All the goblin crap. Let's sell his gloves as well, or maybe keep them for now. Okay, let's keep them. Yes, yeah, let's go. The bottles, what else can we sell? Ooh, a lot of stuff. Okay, guess we're good. Druid, outsiders perhaps, but not me. Lucky you. There have been several attacks by different what monsters. What is the sound? The druids blame us outsiders for drawing them here. Nobody's welcome anymore. They've started a ritual to cut the grove off from the world outside. We can't stay. But we'll be slaughtered if we leave. We're no fighters. I need a healer. Goblin got you. The druid Halsin's a renowned healer. But he didn't make it back from Aradin's expedition. If it's not too serious, you could try his apprentice, Nettie. She's with the other druids in the inner grove. They've withdrawn there to prepare this damn ritual. What brought you here? We are refugees from Elturel. We took shelter here after gnomes attacked us on the road. We were bound for Baldur's Gate, and it was too late to turn back. Elturel had no place for tieflings after the descent. The descent? An infernal conspiracy that had seen the entire city of Elturel briefly drowned to the hells. Your people survive that, they will sure survive anything. So I hoped, but we've lost so many already. And more will die if we're forced out again. This ritual, is there no way to convince the druids to stop? I've tried. Korga, their new first druid, won't even see me. You, though. I know it's not your business, but she owes you for saving this place. Perhaps you could persuade her. For more time to prepare, if nothing else. Hmm, I wonder if we can deal with shadow druids. Like they're they've turned into rats and they're sitting in the grove. But who'll try to kill them? I'll see what I can do. We're messengers here. We'd owe you a great debt. If we're forced to leave now, we won't make it to the city. You'll find the druids at the heart of the grove. Please, make them see sense before more lives are lost. What is this damn sound? I don't remember having it before. Right, let's kill this... Uh... Goblin or whoever he is up here. Or no, no, up here. He never ends. Cannon? He's not breathing! Go find a healer! It's too late. He's gone.
I'm sorry it happened too fast. Someone's going to pay for this. Arka, no, wait! What are you doing? Oh yeah, I forgot to give gloves to no time to die. Shadow Heart. Can't give up now. Why does this keep happening? He was joking about Octa Soup just a moment ago. These Come on, Ricker. And now what? We dig a hole and be done with it. Here we go. This guy tried to sneak up on this girl. Nadira. Got to press on. Five. Shoot him. Damn it. Decent damage. Are we surprised? Riot Guild did not miss this time, which is rare. Down with you. The dance macabre. To feel their anguish. Right, almost done. Right. Let's go. Best be on my way. That's a weird dodge. You have good timing. Never been much of a fighter, so wrestling a bugbear would have gone poorly. But you're not here for heroics, are you? Avernus's stench is all over your skin. Let me guess. Your devil mistress sent you to get her soul coin back. But too bad. I earned it, fair and square. Exception, you got me. Hand the coin over and I'll be on my way. Uh, wait a second. I'm good. Easy. That bloody ironies. Yeah, she don't like that I to lose. deceived her. Here. Now go back to the I wasn't deceiving people you. too much as a paladin. Maybe that's why I wasn't like looking for it. I didn't notice it. Because I'm not a liar. Not lead. Need to find a way forward. You peer through the telescope. A dragon. Let's try to focus. Easy. You see a dragon circling like a bird of prey, hunting. I think first time I've been here, I moved to the left, I started the to go to the right. To the right. Oh, we can see this burning place from here. The telescope points straight ahead.
The telescope the points to the left. I guess that soul doesn't really mean much. The telescope. Damn it, I didn't want it. You got what you came for. Just Can you move the stone? No. Probably not. I think there's some treasure treasure point in here. No? Here? Yeah. Here we go. Something over there. Motion of invisibility. Let's take all of it. Oh, this damn squirrel. Lunges at your foot and bites it. Geek the squirrel. Now let's try animal handling. We are a druid after all. Easy. You follow the squirrel's gaze to a pair of clumsy, ugly feet. Your own on her territory. Looking around, her territory extends from one end of the grove. To another. Kick her anyway. Let's assert our dominance. Damn it. Crap. She chatters back louder and at length. Tail rigid with irritation, she scampers off. I guess we have won in some way. And the sleep doesn't work because of the bear sleeping down there. Alright. It's kind of late. Streamed for three hours already. Yes, yeah, that's it. Let's. I wasn't expecting it, but I'm good. Let's stop on this for today. Yes, thanks for watching. Have a nice weekend and take care.